What's going on guys? It's your boy Terabyte Reacts here, enjoying some of my beautiful invisible juice. <laughs> Anyways, um, we are back again with another reaction, man. Um, Code Geass R2, man. Season 2 has been amazing so far. You guys know how much I'm enjoying this anime. Um, it's so good. <laughs> Anyways, man, we're gonna jump into these the, into this super reaction real quick. We're gonna do three episodes today, and then I'm gonna finish up this season um, with a um, from. So we're gonna go 18 to 20 today, and then I'm just gonna finish up the season with the last what, what? How much episodes is that? Six episodes. Then I'm gonna finish that up. Um next week so what i'm going to do is this so that you guys know because this is the code gears video so that you guys know what's what's going on and what i'm planning to do as as you guys already know if you have not seen it on the community tab i told you guys this is game of thrones week so i'm going to be posting a lot of game of thrones content and reacting to a lot of stuff that i have backed up due to the fact that season eight premieres on sunday um so there's gonna be a lot of game of thrones content on the channel so what i am going to do is you won't get the code gear super reaction um finale till until next week you're gonna get we're gonna get to episode 20 today and then we're gonna do 21 through 25 next week the reason for that why you're not gonna get it this week is because i'm gonna finish up attack on titan season this thursday okay i'm gonna finish that up okay so you guys the only anime that's gonna come out on the channel t um for tuesday is just gonna be this reaction this this cool Gias three episodes and then we're gonna do um and then i'm gonna give you guys evangelion but the attack on titan i'm gonna finish that up next on thursday right because it's it's longer um so that's what i'm planning to do okay so i am going to go um i haven't made that announcement yet it's just that when i was um driving home you know it came to me and said you know what let me just wait and just get the game of thrones content up and running on the channel because it was bad if i don't get anything done tonight and it's like already monday going into tuesday so if tuesday i don't have anything up it's gonna be wednesday before i can get anything up and i don't want that to happen so i'm gonna jump into these reactions man there's other stuff that i'm doing that i'm preparing for also um didn't get a chance to record anything over the weekend because i was trying to prepare certain things i'm still working on the intro the new intro that i'm working on i'm still because I want it to be so good, I'm working on it. Because <clears throat> I'm a bit of a perfectionist, but I'm not, <laughs> I'm not gonna say that. Um, something I there things that I care about, like this YouTube channel, my business stuff like that. Like I obsess about them until stuff gets done. Like it's perfect. Like I can say yes, I have accomplished something. Like that's me. So. Um, so we're gonna jump into this reaction, man. Um, so look out for those announcements. Um, hopefully the Attack on Titan guys they see the announcement when it comes out. Um, but if they, if you, if you guys are watching this video too, um, then you already know. Okay, so we're gonna jump into this reaction. You guys already know what happened in the last three episodes that we saw. It was straight just fire stuff. So I want to see what's gonna happen now um in in the series and how they're going to transition into the last few episodes last super reaction that we're going to do if you have not seen my review go and check it out it's one of the things i'm trying to not do too much in my intro is to is to encourage you guys if you have not seen the last reaction to not dwell too much on what i said before because you know i like to review the previous episode but i just hit like you know um the main points of the episodes that's what i'm trying that's what i'm trying to say like the main points of what happened in the last super reaction that we did um um Callan is i don't know why the hell suzaku i mean suzaku is 
he is conflicted right now because he doesn't know really what to do. And I understand him him understanding or trying to understand he's the reason why Lelouch. So now Lelouch cannot, can't even... Lelouch has lost complete trust in him now because and he unknowingly led them to him. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's not really his fault, but Lelouch is not going to see it like that because he doesn't know really what he, he's thinking that you lured, you lured me here again. You know what I'm saying? You put me in a position, you know, you, you let me lose all my memories because you took me to the emperor and now you're trying to lure me in again. Even though I've began to trust you again, you've completely shattered that trust once again. So, um, even though we know that Suzaku didn't, Suzaku actually wanted to work with him um, to get some things um, actually done, but them dudes show up. So now, I don't know if they're gonna treat Suzaku as a traitor because he has he has a choice to make at this point. Because they're looking at him and be like, oh, so you still wanted to work with him? You know what I'm saying? Like, we didn't know you had this kind of connection. You knew all along and blah, 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 blah. So, I don't know what's going to happen. The Emperor showed up on screen for, like, we don't know if he's still missing or not. You get what I'm saying? Like, we don't know if he's still trapped in the world. Was it a pre-recording? Uh... I'm not sure yet. Is he really back? If he's back, then good. We um, He's an essential part of the story, so I don't want to see them just, you know, off with him or whatever and then make it like about Snit um, Snit Snitzel now. Like, I, I don't want to, even though he's a worthy adversary for Lelouch at this point, zero, I still don't want him to become that. I still think the Emperor's you get what I'm saying? Like, I still believe the Emperor is still that dude. You know what I'm saying? Like, he is the ultimate um, villain. You get what I'm saying? Like, so, um, what is the decision that Cornelia is going to make? Like, that's another thing that I'm worried, that I'm thinking about too. What is she going to do now that she knows pretty much who Lelouch is, that Lelouch is zero, like, she knows... Um, and it's just, I mean, there's so much. There's so much. Let's just go jump into the episode, man. And then we'll talk about this in the review, man. Because I'm going to be here for another 15 minutes talking about how great the last Super Reaction was. So if you have not seen it, man, just go check it out. Check out my review on it. It was awesome. I think, I think I'm doing a, well, I don't like patting myself on the back. But hey. I know I'm doing a great job because, you know what I'm saying, you guys say it all the time. That's the only reason why I know I'm doing a good job is because you guys tell me all the time. I love your reviews, man. I love how you break things down, all of this other good stuff. So, we're going to jump into this reaction, man. I'll see you guys for the review. Remember, link is down in the description. All you have to do is click the link, go watch it. Whether it whether be. Sometimes I don't have a second link, uh, but it comes that I, I'll add it to the video later because sometimes when I do upload to Bit BitChute, it does give me problem with processing. Um, but if it goes through, I'll put it up. If it doesn't and you guys are not having problems, nobody complaining, then I'll just don't bother uploading to BitChute if you get what I'm saying. So thank you guys for watching. As always, I'll see you guys for the review. All right, so here we go, man. Code Geass, episode 18, 19, and 20. Whew, a lot happened. A lot has happened, man. A lot has happened. But I just want to get down. We, we um, apparently, Nunnally is dead because of the Flasia, or whatever they call that nuke. Um, that was, it was sad. It was sad. I mean, he, as I was saying before, he is losing everybody that is kind of like pretty much everybody that he uses this Gias on, except, um, 
except for Suzaku. Suzaku is the only person that he's used the Gias on so far that survives. Nobody else. Everybody that he's used the Gias on that was significant in the story has died. Even the <laughs> this is nuts. I think the only people surviving that he's used the Gias on, which I don't know if it's been canceled. Um, Cornelia is one of them. I think she's the only one that's still alive. Um, and, um, oh girl, the black, the black chick. Um, what's her name again? B. <laughs> I can't remember her name, man. But y'all know who I'm talking about. The black chick with the purple hair, man. Um, can't remember her name. Ogie's girl, All right? I think those two are the only ones, in, including Suzaku. So it, it's like I'm trying to get my thoughts together because there's so many things that happen in those three episodes, man. That's why I said this these this anime it has to be up there. It has to be in everybody's top 10 of all times. And it's not just because I haven't watched like a ton of anime. Because I know some people out there, they've watched a shit ton of anime, right? Um, for me, it's just like I've maybe watched in entirety, maybe, I don't know. I want to say probably around 10 series. I want to say like it's not much that I've watched in entirety. You know what I'm saying? And still those that are still ongoing and stuff like that so it's not much compared to a lot of people so maybe that's why it's in my top 10 but i think this is one of those animes that not just because of popularity and stuff like that like just diving into it you can tell why it would be in someone's top 10 you know what i'm saying um so it's just certain things. Kyle, um, Colin got out. I was happy about that. Colin got out the Gurren as a upgrade because they've been working on the Gurren. Um, so he's got a got a upgrade from from Lloyd. Uh, so that was dope. The wings way more powerful than anything they they have. So that's dope. Um, of course, um, Miss um, what's her name? <laughs> I'm trying to remember these names. Oh my god, I'm trying to remember these names, man. They, they are, they're slipping me right now because there's so much information I want to get out. As I said, this is gonna be a long review because it's so much that took place. But I know you guys know what I'm talking about. The guy, the 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 girl, she's she designs for um. She's design. She designs the stuff for for the Black Knights, right? So she must be real. She she was salty because you heard you heard what she said. How dare they touch the Gurren without my permission, <laughs> right? So that was pretty dope um, to see how she just hopped in and just was clearing the battlefield. But let's talk about the main points of these three episodes, though. Um, the Black Knights finding out about that um Snice will come in to, to drop the big news on him letting them know hey it's my brother that's zero it's Lelouch you know what I'm saying um I didn't like how it went down how they just I, I'm you know even though dude was trying to be like nah it's no way no way no way but then as soon as they got a little proof you know what I'm saying they all fell some sort of way you know I didn't like how quick they were ready to kill him or hand him over without even saying, but he's our guy. Let's talk to him, hear what he has to say. You get what I'm saying? I, I think that would have been better like, listen, we need, to, we need to have a talk. Even if they wanted to do it the same way, but it's like somebody should have came out instead of just attacking him outright like that. You know what I'm saying? With, with DTR, with the camera and everything. You know what I'm saying? Like, listen, man, you, we've been through, we've been in the gutter together. 
We've been in this war together for all this time. The least, the least you can do is give Zero a chance to explain himself. You get what I'm saying? Other than we all know that he was just talking out of his ass to just to just end it, right? To just end it saying that they're, you know, they took so long to figure it out. Yes, it's me. It's Lelouch. Blah, 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 blah. You know what I'm saying? Um, he was in a tough situation there. Rolo came in with the save, um, even though, you know what I'm saying, I didn't expect it because of what he, um, earlier in the episode, what he, what he said to him, you know what I'm saying, basically saying that, how come you haven't figured it out all this time? He was upset, you know what I'm saying, and then Rolo basically sacrificed himself to save him. So, everybody, man. Two tragic deaths. I, even though I wasn't a huge fan of Rolo, he went out like a G. You get what I'm saying? Like, he went out believing that he wasn't a pawn, that he wasn't used. Which, in, tr in truth and in fact, maybe Lelouch was trying to tell him that at the end to make him feel comfortable with and, and you know, okay with dying. And, you know, to make him go go with some sort of peace, you know what I'm saying, uh, but I really do feel like Lelouch, he doesn't love anyone as much as he loves Nunnally, so I didn't like the fact that Rolo was trying to, was going to kill Nunnally, so that, you know, he could be the only sibling, which is just, you know, kind of selfish on his part, because, you know, so at that point, you know, I wasn't really feeling him on, on any kind of level, but I didn't want the way how he went, the way how he died, he died doing what he what he actually wanted to do, which is to protect um Lelouch, which is very noble of him. You know him coming in to save Lelouch like that was very surprising. So that was cool. Right, Charles, he don't give a goddamn. <laughs> He's just out here trying to use this this weapon of mass destruction, right? To kill everybody. You don't care about his <laughs> the man called the war mundane, bro. Who's that? Yo, I don't give a shit about this war, bro. Like anything you got gotta do. Talk to Snitel. So Snitel, he decided to declare himself emperor. Emperor, Emperor, right? He decided to declare himself Emperor, which is actually, that's treason, okay? That's a coup, as they called it, for what it is. Um, so, and Suzaku, in turn, became the new um, Knight of the One, right? Because that's... He claims that's the reason why he did what he did, was to become the Knight of the One, right? So, there's, there's so many things that happen in these episodes, man. And I'm, I'm thinking about it all at once because it, 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 it was a bit overwhelming, not in a bad way, in a very good way. It was overwhelming. It was exciting. It was finding out all this stuff but the biggest reveal of it all of these three episodes was the fact that Marion is not dead he, she's not dead she's been posing as freaking she's been I don't I don't even know if this I still don't believe it I still don't believe that that's actually her this this guy's this Anya and CC's got her memory back because she she freaking locked her gears on purpose. She locked away her code on purpose, so, right? Because I was wondering what the hell was happening way back when they interacted for the first for, on that first time when the when the two of them connected. And they had some sort of weird flashback and stuff. I was wondering, what the hell is happening to her? Why is she affected? 
right? But we all know this stuff happens when CC touch people. So, or not necessarily in direct contact with them, but something that they're touching, I don't know. But it's, I was wondering what that was all about. And they kind of cleared it up in that episode. But if Mar, if Marianne is still alive, bro, they call her Marianne the Flash. Now, you got a badass name like that. You know she all about the business. She going to give you that work. Okay. So some people have been wondering if I, you know what I'm saying, in the comment section, if it, they're saying by now I should know that it's Lelouch's mom. Of course I know that Marianne is Lelouch's mom. I know that, guys. I know that. I have addressed it in the comment section already. That when I say I want to know more about her, about her, that doesn't mean I doesn't know that simple fact. We we know that. We know that. I know that. Right. I just want to know what made her so revered. Like people talk about her like she's the shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? So that's really what I want to know. Like it would have been nice to get a um, in that reveal. Maybe the next episode after that reveal, they gave some sort of backstory on her. That would have been nice. Right. Um, Now would be a good time for for, for them to show how she died or why the hell she's still alive right that would be great hopefully they do do something like that um so it's great man and now lelouch has locked himself and charles into this damn place <sighs> it's just so much him he's found a new purpose um yo kakia is like yo there is only one person that would go over there trying to attack your Britannian forces right now. Only one person. Y'all over here talking about Zero is dead? I'm not believing that shit. I need to see the body, homie. I need to see the body. Show me the body bag. Show me the face. Okay? Because she mad because, you know what I'm saying, that was her boo unofficially. You know what I'm saying? So, she's not going to let that shit go for, for anything she was she's really hurt by the fact that she you know that they were telling her that zero is that she was really hurt by it even though they're you know they're the unofficial couple in the show you know what i'm saying like she she just decides that hey zero is the guy she is the only one that can drop these draws okay don't worry about it <laughs> so I'm glad that she stood up with shoes and she was like, yo, we coming with you. You ain't going nowhere by yourself. We 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 call this ceasefire, right? So we're not gonna be fighting. If we call a ceasefire, who the hell is over there attacking you? <laughs> Cause it ain't us. It ain't us. We ain't sending no forces over there. So it's gotta be somebody that we know, and it's only one person that would do that, and that is zero. So let's get it. Right, so Lelouch went over there, um, Suzaku <laughs> went over there, but I'm not sure if the Knight of the One that's over there, the previous one before Suzaku, right, I don't know if he's got a Gias or he was under the influence of Gias, but I did see his eye. I think, I think he's under the influence of the Gias. I don't think, I don't think he has a Gias. I think he's under the influence because it was that red glow. I saw a red glow. I didn't actually see a Gias in his eye. So I think he's under the influence rather than um, having a Gias of his own. So pretty dope, pretty dope story so far, man. Can't wait to watch the ending. Um, so I'm, I've been rambling for 15 minutes now. Um, so got to i gotta end this um i will i will try and talk more about this at the end of the next super reaction which is going to happen next week if you don't know now you know guys i am going to finish up the series next week so the next what six episodes which is going to be 21 through 25 um i'm going to do that all in one big super reaction next week to end the season um and wrap and wrap things up um there will be no attack on titan um for ch for tomorrow tuesday but i'm going to be finishing that up on thursday that's why i'm not doing a super reaction for code kiosk 
on Thursday. I will be putting this in the community tab and announcing this in the um the Discord on the Discord server. So if you have not joined yet, go ahead, man. Join the Discord server. We have great conversations over there. Um, you'll know about things a lot sooner. Great conversations. If you want to go talk spoilers with other people, you can do that over there in a the specific channel. Over there, we talk about different animes. Everything that's going on in the channel is being discussed over there every now and then. Okay? Um, so thank you guys for watching. As always, man, this, this anime... It blows my mind every time I watch it. I wish I could just watch the whole thing one time and just find out everything. But because I have to do this for YouTube, I can't do that. So we'll binge next week, though, for six episodes and and get it done. So tell me, tell me what you think of these three episodes that we just watched, man. Episodes 18, 19, and 20. Um... I know you guys are going to get me hyped for the end of the season. I don't know what's going to happen because at this moment, anything can happen. And I like when, when whether it be TV shows, whether it be anime, I love when things are like that because it's like, you don't know what's going to happen. You know, you have this nut bust look on your face all the damn time. Oh, oh. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, it's just un unexpected stuff. Like, I love that because when you can predict a story, it is not enjoyable. You know what I'm saying? So I love when, when TV shows and anime, I love when they surprise me because you can have a, a perspective, a situation, a plan, a prediction in your mind of what you think might happen. And then they completely surprise you because you, you weren't thinking that that's the way, the direction that they would go. When shows do that, man, it's refreshing. It's great. So thank you guys for watching as always. Um, remember to subscribe if you have not subscribed yet. Leave a like on this video and leave a comment in the comment section, man. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. We're good out here, Terror Squad. It's your boy, Terror by Reacts. And peace.